Hey guys, what's going on? So I bring you a junkyard video today. I'm looking for an engine for that charger, actually an engine block. I happened to stumble across this. Uh, this is a 2006 Chrysler 300. A lot of you guys know that these early Hemis had a lot of issues with uh, the valve seats dropping. And this is a prime example right here of this engine here. If you look down there, cylinder number six there, um, the passenger side you can see what happened with the piston there and luckily these pistons are aluminum pistons they're not steel pistons so they're not really going to do a lot of damage to the to the block itself when they grenade like this so that's a good thing so looking at the rest of the block the rest of the block looks pretty pretty good but I think we're going to come back and grab this engine here in another few days the thing with this engine is you can see the transmission if you look in the back there where the transmission goes or actually in the transmission tunnel uh, the transmission is gone so this basically all we'll have to do is just lift this engine right up out of here not a problem whatsoever but this is a good candidate for that charger that I have the problem with that charger that we're having with it is one is it's gone through a lot of oil it's consuming a lot of oil and when I say consuming a lot of oil it's going through about a quart every six seven hundred miles so that's pretty it's pretty bad if you ask me. So let's go ahead and look at the cylinder head here. So looking at our cylinder head here, someone was very generous to already go ahead and pull this apart for us and inspect the damage on this engine here. Looking at cylinder number six here, we already can see that there's an issue with the valve, the, the intake valve there. Looking at all the other valves, they all look perfect, but this is an issue with these Chrysler's, these early Hemi's, they drop these valve seats and this is the problem that you occur right here and this is what you see and this is the damage from when it drops the valve seat into the cylinder and you can look at that piston inside the engine there and that's a direct result of it dropping a valve seat and this would be the valve seat on the intake side of the valve so but overall I mean the rest of the car looks to be in really nice shape the oil chain sticker says 156,000 miles on it when it's due for its next oil change so that tells me that this car has got virtually the same miles that it's that that charger of mine has so what I'm going to do I'm going to come back and pull this engine out of it and I know that we'll have a good block anyways I'm going to conclude this video today guys I really appreciate everybody joining me here today please like comment and subscribe and we'll catch you guys on the next one see ya